हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू नॉलेज निंजा एकेडमी सो इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू सी द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ मिलिंग कटर्स और मिलिंग मशीन्स सो फर्स्ट वन यू सी हॉरिजॉन्टल मिलिंग मशीन सो इन द हॉरिजॉन्टल मिलिंग मशीन basically it is it is said that when the axis of the cutter the milling cutter is horizontal then it is called as horizontal milling machine so consider this is a cutter a milling cutter and its axis is horizontal to the table so basically table is also horizontal here and there is work piece on the table so this is the horizontal milling machine so there may be arrangement of uh, holding this uh, tool in place and the table okay so similarly there is second one vertical milling machine so in vertical milling machine the axis of the milling cutter is vertical so the axis of milling cutter is vertical and the bed will be horizontal so there will be a work piece rested on the table so now the next one is column and knee type milling machine so in column and knee type milling machine column is called as the structural member which will support the milling cutters and the tool holding device so just consider that here it is a milling cutter It is a vertical milling cutter, and it is been held into the work uh, tool holding device. This, and this is column. This portion is column, which is supporting this tool. And below that, there will be a knee, which will support the table on which the work piece will be mounted. Okay. so it will be a table and it will be called as knee knee will be a structural member which will support the table so there will be according to the uh, axis of the uh, cutters there will be two types horizontal and vertical so whenever you will get across the names horizontal column and knee type milling machine so it will be horizontal axis column and knee type milling machine and when there will there will, there will be uh, a name like vertical column and knee type milling machine so this will be a vertical and vertical column and knee type milling machine so next we will see the tool motions so basically consider this is a table so there will be some motions which we will desire so basically if it is x direction it is y direction and 
perpendicular z direction so the motions we desire are horizontal x and minus x okay so to the right it will be positive x to the left it will be negative x similarly according to y direction y x minus x y minus y and there will be a z direction also z plus and z minus also there will be some rotational motion to the table okay so rotational motion will be like this horizontally and this will be horizontally and there will be a vertical rotation also it will be called as vertical rotation so now according to this we will have some types okay so first will be a universal milling machine so in universal milling machine the machine will be having a table fitted with all the motions and a dividing head with ability to perform any type of milling operations okay so here cutter will be either horizontal or vertical so we can choose both of these so and then we will have table motions like plus x minus x then plus y minus y then plus z minus z and also one horizontal rotational motion horizontal rotation so when there will be a horizontal motion okay sorry so when uh, a table of universal milling machine will be having plus x minus x plus y minus y and plus z minus z motions along with one rotational horizontal motion now many different complex uh, shapes can be formed with the help of milling machine this universal milling machine so another type is there it will be called as one second there is another type it is called as omni versal milling machine so in omni versal milling machine all the properties of universal milling machines are there along with one vertical rotational motion in work with one vertical rotation there will be plus x minus x plus y minus y and plus z and minus z so omniversal milling machine in this omniversal milling machine table can be tilted in a vertical plane also okay and both of these milling machines are column and knee type milling machines column and knee type machines milling machines so the omniversal milling machine is used for limited purpose like experimental 
experimental and tool room applications so it will be have having a limited use omniversal meaning machine